every single one of these. Look, take a look at all these commons here. There sure is a lot of commons, huh? I need to tell you something. These comments are actually all from me. I was role playing. Every single one of these people, Slacker Nim, Henry Noper, Jim Nerd, Bobby Earp, Garbwer, Bibrop, those days were all made up. I don't know anybody with those names. Even Thomas Nuckles is a fake name. Nespe Pencil. There's no such name as Nesapede Pencil. John Nurb. Even Ardor Burkdime is a fake name. Now, Jimmy James is a real name, but I still made it a fake name. All, all these accounts are all, are all my accounts. I just happen to use different names for them. I logged in on my computer and just hit switch account dozens of times using different browsers because you can only log into 10 accounts at the same time so in order for me to comment on 10 more accounts I had to use a different browser but yeah I, I role played like crazy I was like this oh yeah party at my house right Come on, man. At 721, you admitted that your friend went to bed earlier than 1030 in the morning. At least he didn't party too hard. Then he says, he's just making up the times when he went for bed. Keep watching more episodes. He actually replied to every single person. I mean, I feel kind of bad. You know? He actually has autism. So I was... I, I Once he said that he had autism... I went ahead and started to tell him that I'd be calling up all my friends and, and telling them to watch this video. And he thinks that these are actually my friends, but they're not. They are all me. They're all my accounts. I was just role playing every single one of these comments right here. But hey, I did pretty good. Look at this. Liked and favorited. Bang! Just like that. 456. Who's that pigeon? Wow, that pigeon's got pink wings. How'd that happen? He must have been mutated or something. That's Tori Pinkless. He's on episode, uh, season 8 and season 12. As soon as I heard Walmart, I just went into super engaged mode. Every prank call has Walmart in it. It's just classic. The American Savior says, I know, my friend is crazy about talking about Walmart. I think I'll call my friend over the phone. He needs to stop by my house. Yeah, it's freaking 4.38 a.m. right now. I'm not kidding you. And yes, it was actually 4.38 in the morning when I actually wrote that comment. So that actually isn't too ironic at all. Just so you know. Yes, I was actually up very late. Um, I I slept in very late the next day. But yeah, I I have to admit to American Savior, these comments are all from me. They're not from other people. All right. I mean, there, there were the last three comments were from other people, but all the others were all from me. Very sorry, American Savior. Okay, so now that we got that all out of the way here, let me um, let me tell you about the next shout out here. I would like to shout out Bob Marley. Yes, Bob Merrily has YouTube has a YouTube channel of his Harris Hawks honey. Yes, Bob Merrily is a licensed falconer in California. He hunts his hawks 
in the California desert where it's so quiet that you could literally hear a pin drop. But then once you knock into those bushes, you just kick those bushes, sometimes rabbits just come running right out of the bushes. And it's on. The hunt's on. Yeah, that's right. And they're, they're after it. Like, as soon as he starts kicking the bush, bushes, yeah, they're, they're on to that rabbit. Make sure you subscribe to this channel. He gave me some great advice, and he, he, he really knows what he's doing. He's the best falconer on all of YouTube. I, I kid you not, I, I have yet to find someone better than Bob Myron. And I like the fact that his hawks are free when they're when they're hunting and he never hoods his falcons which is very cool so make sure you check out his channel all right the next the next channel is um, Ben Hill so Ben Hill is a falconer from Georgia which where I'll be moving to very soon. He has videos of a red-tailed hawk named Athena. So make sure you watch these videos. I'm actually considering having him be a sponsor depending on where it is in Georgia I end up living at. He could probably hook me up with a sponsor you know, I would just join the club that he's in, and then I'd be able to find a sponsor that he knows, because there's a lot of people in his club, so he can really hook me up. And thank you, Ben. I really appreciate all the advice you've given me. All right, so there we go. So that's my shout-outs. So I just want to let you know that I, when I watch hawk videos, I only search for like small channels. I don't search for like channels with like tens of thousands of subscribers because they already have enough fans anyways. They already have enough numbers. I would much rather subscribe to small channels, even channels with like less than a thousand subscribers good enough for me and I don't watch anything foreign like I, I prefer to just stick with hawks that live in the US that way I can see them one day in my backyard or possibly when I'm hiking I, I prefer watching red tailed hawk videos than anything else but I do search for Cooper's hawks and red shouldered hawks as well Alright, so there's my video. I hope you enjoyed it. And I'll see you when I end up collecting a Red Tailed Hawk t-shirt. Alright, until then, take care. See ya.